Hello my darlings and welcome to my channel. Um, I heard that this will be your confirmation for some reason, this reading. Also I heard for some there will be urgent messages and I'm not sure yet how I'm gonna call this reading, we'll see how it goes. But if you clicked on it, probably you have a message here that you need to hear. So you may choose from those two uh, balls. Pile 1, orange candle, pile 2, blue candle. Or you may watch both of them. Hello, pile 1. Whoever chose this uh, orange candle in the blue ball. Let's look at you. What kind of urgent messages you need to hear currently. Or... What will be your confirmation why you clicked on this video? Just relax and let's see the messages for you. Okay, right away, here something will take less time than you thought. Something will speed up very fast. Something that uh, took a while will suddenly um, unfold or show up. It could be someone. For some, it's a person that will show up um, out of the blue. Um, this person may have either I see gloves, maybe this person into sport or something like that. Or this person is carrying something in two hands, I hear. could also be your coach, your, um, maybe it's an artist with some, you know, art pieces in their hands or some items. Could be your boss uh, working with certain documents and giving it to you. For others, it's a person, it's a love situation where uh, someone is coming towards you and they carry something basically I see uh, some of you you will maybe spending a lot during the upcoming days but you will also earn fast so it's gonna be um, the money will come and go come and go but you will accomplish things it's not when money just goes it's like coming and uh, going and coming back so don't worry if you may if you will have uh, many expenses uh, in the upcoming future close like days or weeks from whenever you watch this reading because it's gonna come and go you're gonna uh, you you will be able to handle the situation especially if you know you you need to spend on something currently even if it's just paying your bills, you know. I see a little girl with, uh, uh, for some it's a curly hair, but for others it's like, uh, either it's a ponytail or she has, you know, when um, the, oh my god, I forgot how you call it. I see the wax is spilling. So basically a certain way of, um, hair making there is a girl I don't know why she's gonna be in a picture in a certain situation of yours maybe it's your daughter maybe it's uh, your um, sibling maybe it's a random girl for some but this girl will be existing maybe somewhere around this girl will be that's gonna be a confirmation remember uh, I said this really maybe it's a confirmation for someone that something is happening, unfolding, um, speeding up. Or you may see something and this girl will be standing there.
uh, for some of you you will be attending a certain uh, spiritual event or um, maybe even religious event whichever religion you related to or whoever will invite you some religious um, important event like you know there's like a birth of a child a certain birthday or a holiday something you will be attending um, exploring even I hear because you um, either you're not the same religion or uh, you never seen anything like that and it's gonna be some new environment and a new experience for you I also see someone has a heavy heart uh, ab like over you about you somebody's worrying I hear something they didn't say something they maybe hidden from you maybe at certain point of time didn't open up and now they kind of sorry they didn't do something here so someone is regretting not to speak out not to maybe not to treat you the way they want they needed to treat you um someone has a heavy heart and this person is trying to go with their day with their life but they can't they constantly thinking about what happened or what didn't happen and uh, it bothers them Okay, for, for others of you, if you, uh, when you go somewhere or you drive somewhere, if you pass a certain school or col college, no, but more school, maybe you just pass, pass a certain road where there is a school, uh, how do you say, property, you will have a sign there. Either you will passing by, driving by. There is something about this place. Maybe on the billboard somewhere you see a name or a number or something that will be a confirmation for you. This that specific. Okay, now I see someone is offering you either it's a tea or a coffee. A uh, coffee machine can be around. It's like you you accept a certain offering from a person. For some, of, for most of you, it's a woman or could be a man. It's offering you this cup. This is more of a moment in time, and I want to tell you: if you try to avoid a certain situation, or you thought this will never happen, or something that. Um, you didn't expect it will happen and at that moment when this will be happening there will be somebody around you who will offer you a drink but this is not an alcohol drink it's more of like you know um, maybe soda but more I say tea or coffee maybe it's an office I don't know could be anywhere Now I see uh, that someone is looking, if you felt recently that someone is looking at you or from afar or someone is keeping an eye on you, this is, uh, this is not online, this is more of, or maybe you will be sitting somewhere and someone will uh, give you extra attention with their eyes, with their gaze, or maybe they'll turn your way, you're gonna feel a strong... Uh, strong feeling of someone is around you even may feel like hot or warm in your body you turn around and you see this is a person that's looking at you and their look their gaze is very powerful for some reason why um okay what's what's with that person or situation why you need to here i want to open one card guys i have to um see that and look 
Uh, this person may be even um, somebody who will ask for donation, could be homeless person. You're going to feel their gaze or their, um, it's going to be so powerful that you would want to give them either some pennies or money or something. It's in like an exchange for their energy. I don't know why you will be exchanging energy with... So it doesn't have to be a homeless person, but here I open the card, Six of Pentacles. Maybe this person will ask something. Maybe they'll just look at you. Um, maybe they would want to start talking to you. Or maybe you know them, but they never spoke to you and now they would like to approach you. Let them approach you, hear them out. Because somehow you're exchanging energy with them. And it's, uh, I hear uh, it's needed. I don't know why you, you see later on why it's, it was needed, but it's kind of needed for a certain activation. Yeah. Uh, just be cautious. Doesn't mean everyone who comes uh, at you, approaches you, you have to talk to random people. No. But you're going to feel a certain gaze. Now I see a new moon. Even though I know there is a full moon coming up soon. Uh, for some reason it shows me a new moon phase. And the new moon is coming like, I don't know about it, around 3 weeks. 2-3 weeks. Something will be happening around the new moon. Please remind me someone to do a reading about the new moon. For some reason it's important. Maybe the message will be in the new moon reading for you. The upcoming new moon reading by me. Unless I forget, but some someday I will do it, right? <laughs> but some message is there during the new moon. I also see... Um, I see a, a woman carrying, like, uh, in her hands, carrying a child. But this is more of a metaphor. I feel like somebody will be acting like a child around you even if they could be an adult and you will be wondering why this person um, acts a certain way like a child and you're gonna be like maybe you're gonna even see another way or another side of a person when they are uh, vulnerable or where they are more impulsive um, not serious and you kind of gonna understand that this person not the way you portrayed them before you may be uh, opening your eyes to uh, to someone that you thought they one person now they are not exactly who you thought they are I don't see that you're upset about it it's just it's just a thing it's just gonna unfold for you I see a little dog and I see this little dog um, following some steps. Yes, I, I want to tell you somebody wants to reach out to you, it could be a friend or someone who maybe you didn't speak for a while or it was a certain stagnation and disconnection. Somebody wants to get you back as a friend I hear. Or they want to feel safe in this connection again. It's like somebody feels unsafe in you, between you and them. Like there is a certain connection. It could be a close friend. It could be just some somebody that you just knew one day, you know. They don't feel safe um, about this connection. And they would want to contact you to make sure that you're still around. Or you still care for them. Or you... I don't know, somebody would like to contact you just to check on you. You may receive a message within the next 10 hours even. Up to 10 days for some. Uh, depends on your situation. Somebody would want to um, confirm if you are still okay with them. Um, I don't see this as selfishness, like they afraid to lose you because they want your attention or no. It's more like... They just, I don't know why I hear the word safe. They feel unsafe. They feel like 
maybe you don't care anymore or you kind of went on with your life and don't pay attention to them to this person but they do care and they will show themselves actually let me see what else you have here if you see something this will be your personal confirmation that you may share in the comment section okay many i see many confirmations will be coming from the universe in the upcoming days uh in the form of a cloud in the form of even uh when you're gonna see if you live around water or somewhere where there is like a lake or something uh you may see figures in the water while the water is moving especially if it's like um, water that stays like it's not uh, wavy I also see a person standing next to a sink and trying to open a sink and the water is flowing and you could have this moment when you just stuck in your thoughts the water is running right but you kind of stuck in your thoughts in that moment you will get a certain insight something will show up some Either it's a sign from the universe, there is a message that's coming through. It's like you are in a kind of meditative mode. There is a water around, or as I said, just a sink could be uh, flowing of a flowing water. And you just for a second you kind of um, stop doing anything and you get a message. Something's coming through, some information is coming through. It could even be through someone else like whatever you will receive it, this information will be confirmed by another person eventually but very soon this is a fast moving energy for especially for uh, like at least for pile one this is a very fast moving energy you had here you can even see that i'm talking like fast or unusual or um this is urgent this is uh, fast this is something is coming unfolding thank you pile number one and let me know in comments if something already have resonated with you and i'm going for pile number two hello pile two whoever chose the blue candle and let's look at you what will be your confirmation or what urgent messages you need to hear right now about your life your situation or in general just relax, don't cross your legs. Um, and let's start. You have a certain mirror in the house, some of you. Either this mirror needs to be gone or this mirror needs to be changed I see it's either on the left side when you walk into the room or straight forward and you need to push it either to more to the right or to the end corner of the room. I don't know even how to explain it. I have no idea what is this about or who will resonate with it. But for some of you there is a mirror that's reflecting a negativity, right? And uh, you need to change its place or you need to literally remove it. I also heard that it could be there was a person in your home or somewhere around this mirror who once looked in that mirror. Wow, guys, this is, this is something I never caught before. Such an insight, such a channeling. But you may have had someone in your house who looked in that mirror once. This person is jealous of you. Or this person has lots of negativity in them. It could be not related to you. It could be just their life. And now this mirror either needs to be, as I said, removed, cleaned, or replaced to another side. But it's good also to come with sage to clean. The, always remember, clean your mirrors, um, especially when you look at them uh, at, from time to time. Not every day, of course, but... Uh, especially if there are mirrors that you always use make sure they are clean or no other people looking in those mirrors because it may affect your mood it may affect your energy
heavy energy. Again, remember, this is a general reading. It's not doesn't mean you have to get rid of things. You they are just fine, or you don't want to. But you, for those who will res, it will resonate with you, understand what exactly what I'm talking about. You felt it some way, some reason. Uh, okay, another message comes through a relative of a relative. The relative of a relative that's not your relative. I hope it's not confusing, but this person is very interested in you or in your family, in your business. For everyone, it's going to be different. So basically, um, your families, they are related, but they're not uh, your blood or they're not exactly related to you. So this, some person is interested in pile two or in their business or in their life. Why? Uh, because I opened some cards for pile one. Uh, I want to open some card for you. Why this person is interested in pile two? What's the reason? The hermit came through. One more. And the magician. Well, this person uh, wants to be like you. Someone here wants to know uh, how you... And look at that. I have this... I just had this triangle or pyramid just now you know the um they think that you know the key to the how to the pyramid how to maybe make more money or how to um, how to be successful or how to be attractive some some you have a certain key that you they think you're hiding or you have an answer to the question that they are looking for So they clo uh, watch you closely for those reasons. I don't see this person is like negative or they may affect your success. It's more of uh, this person is watching you carefully. And look, now I have some feet or uh, toes and foot like uh, of an animal. Maybe this person has an animal or you have. Maybe it's a dog. Or it just shows their steps. It's like they may follow your steps in something. Or I also heard that they're preparing for a next move in their life in some way. Where they will uh, use your tactic, your... Um, your skills. Someone wants to know the key to the success and they because they feel you are the key or you know the key where the key lies right hmm very interesting i'm asking could this be a love story yes for some this person could be literally interested in pile two Okay, for some of you in the upcoming three days, follow your dreams. Follow what you dream of at night or whenever you're in a meditative state. But mostly I feel when you sleep, when you asleep, the next three days you will have vivid dreams or... Um, and those dreams, they may not even be like clear. You may even forget about them for some time. And then you remember them when it, it's like actually deja vu. You're going to think it's a deja vu. But actually, when things will start happening, this will be a, a moment from your dream. It's like you already been there. But no, you dreamed of it already. Something you dreamed of, you may not remember right away. For some, you will remember. But for others, you're not going to remember this dream. You know, there's times when we wake up and like, oh my God, I dreamed of so many things, but I have no idea what was it. I forgot everything, right? But it lays in your subconscious still. Your subconscious already knows what will happen. So, 
you will only understand the dream or re recall the dream when it actually here when it actually happens and this dream may sh um, come to life within the next few months from whenever you watch this reading from one day up to few months Oh, pile two, uh, someone is in love with you here. Someone dreams of union with you here. This person could have a wide body or shoulders. Wide shoulders for some. They're manifesting a union. Not sure if you want it, <laughs> but... Someone's manifesting union with you. And I feel like they will, uh, at least, they will manifest uh, seeing you somewhere, talking to you somewhere. Yes, uh, I turned the other deck and it's the Ace of Cups. They're manifesting uh, a chance to see you somewhere. Somebody's manifesting you guys. Okay, uh, others of you will be surprised because within the next 10 days you may open a new business for yourself. And you may, uh, you may say, oh, I'm not planning, what 10 days, right? But it may be that the idea that you will get soon or the idea that somebody else will get, you will need to uh, notarize it or you will need to go and actually open uh, an account somewhere, a business, go, I don't know, to the bank, to sign some papers so you would be amazed like oh in 10 days or like close up time you already have a business or a new business and you're like what the hell well when did this happen right so you will be kind of surprised and this is why the urgency of these messages that i said in the beginning and also for pile one certain things will happen and unfold something that uh you thought it will take more time or forever is actually already happening. You're in a moment of creation currently. So uh, don't be too surprised when things will start happening unexpectedly very, very fast. Uh, if you want to know more about this urgency of specifically this reading in general, go to pile one. I'm explaining it there. Sorry, guys. Okay. I see, like, uh, who is this? This looks like some animal or a goat. Someone's playing with balloons. Maybe it's a um, birthday party or child child's party event yeah some uh, you will be in a in a moment when things uh, were people screaming out of happiness laughter eating good foods i see lots of sweets and drinks could be uh, fruit i see fruit punches cocktails but more of like you know not alcohol more or less okay file number two you will meet someone you didn't see for a while I see a, um, a loud hello or sarcastic hello or unexpected hello. So face to face you'll meet someone, you'll see someone and you like, you will be like, this is a moment of, um, how do you say it, startled? You will be like, what is going on? Why this person is in my face? Why are they here? how in the world we met maybe after so many years or after so many struggles or 
maybe you know this person doesn't live in your city or country and then suddenly you bump into them I see they're smiling for some of you they wouldn't even say that they recognize you or they would it's like they may even hide that they recognized you and pass you by but in reality they know who you are I hear. they know who you are for some they will stop you or come to your face and say hello but for others they may pass by but you both know who you just seen and this is going to be something you will be thinking about for the rest of the day at least after you see this person I don't know why someone is holding look at this <laughs> now it's actually holding a margarita cocktail <laughs> Or singing karaoke. Uh, some party is going on here, guys. On this side. Okay, I'll also see another person like, I don't know why I want to say king of water. <laughs> king of cups. Um, maybe this person is a water sign. Maybe they live next to the water. Or they uh, work around like water or something like that. Why we see this person here? Who is this person showed up? Or somebody may be in love with you. I don't know. Who is this, uh, let's say, King of Cups? Page of Cups. Uh, this person could be young, younger than you. This could be a new young love. Or this could be a new admirer of yours that's coming. Something fresh. Oh my God. Oh my God. The Empress. Is this a love offer or a marriage offer from a king of cups? Confirmation, please. Yes, guys, I cannot make this up. And I have the lovers at the bottom of the deck. You may be surprised that someone will offer you either a dating or a relationship or marriage. And you will need to choose. You will be choosing should you say yes or no. But uh, there is an offer coming. I'm asking, could it be a job? No. This is uh, for those who... Um, I don't see that you expect it. I cannot say this is for those who expect uh, a love offer or marriage offer. No. You most likely don't expect this. Or maybe you'll meet somebody and it, the, the offer will come very fast, within the next three months. And you wouldn't even realize how you already made it. Uh, again, remember, uh, this reading is kind of fast forward. Like imagine I'm going to put my voice on uh, X2 of uh, how I'm talking faster. Uh, that's exactly how the events will be unfolding. Something that took a while may take very little time. And you will barely have any time to make a decision. Okay? Uh, yeah, a decision making between two things or two people or yes or no or should I or I shouldn't. Also, somebody may wear a cap or a hat here. Number six and number eight could also be a certain date, number or important uh, synchronicity. Anyways, that's what I had for you today, guys. I love you all, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.